Yo, what is up, you guys? Lone Wolf here, and I'm bringing you a very special video. Um, what I'm about to show you here, I don't know if it's gonna be true. I don't know if it is true. Could be fake. It, honestly, I thought it was photoshopped at first. That's what I think, but it could be true. You never know. Now, if this is actually fake and it's not real, let's go ahead and share this video if you like it. Now, I'm, I'm sure you guys will like this. I mean, I, I, mean, I geeked out, but um. If you like it and you want it to be true, go ahead and share this video. Let's try and push this video to the developers of Call of Duty, you know. Let's try and push it to Treyarch. Let's try and push it to Infinity Ward, Sledgehammer. Let's try and push it to all of them. Retweet this video or retweet the tweet to my video or share the video. And let's go ahead and just send it to them. And hopefully they see this video and hopefully they get the, like, the sparks, sparks their brain that gives them the idea. They might have already gotten this idea, but they're, I don't know if they're going to do it or not. But anyway, let's get right into the video. Now, what happened is, I saw this picture online, and these are two different editions of Call of Duty. And these are um, the old Call of Duty games remastered in the next generation graphics, such as PS4 and Xbox One. Now, I got so, like, I, I geeked out when I saw this because this would be so sweet. It really would. There's two editions of this. There's one. There's Call of Duty Nuclear Edition. It's remastered, remastered for next gen. 90 multiplayer maps, Black Ops 2 League Play, plus rank system, and esports land settings. And it includes Call of Duty 4, MW2, and Call of Duty mw3 all-in-one next generation graphics they might these might be separate games and like that's what i'm thinking like it's a bundle um honestly i think it, i think it's fake because it says black ops 2 league play and it doesn't make any sense but uh let's get on to the next it would be cool though wouldn't it that like i, I can you just imagine it but anyway let's get into the next one the next one is the call of duty revived edition it is call of duty world at war call of duty black ops and then Call of Duty Black Ops 2. And it says the same thing in the description, but instead of like 90, it says 79 multiplayer maps plus Black Ops 2 league play and rank system and 29 zombie maps. Now, I do understand that Treyarch is coming out with a new game this year, and it's probably going to have zombies. We know, we all know Treyarch is going to have zombies regardless. Just because it's a Call of Duty game made by Treyarch, it's going to have zombies. You, you, you kind of have to expect it. But anyway... On the other hand, it would be really freaking cool to see uh, World at War and Black Ops and Black Ops 2 and remastered in next generation graphics. We all know, but hope, like, it just looks, just imagine right now. Think to yourself, what would this look like? It just, it'd be sweets, you know? But I don't think that, I don't think it's going to happen because they're going to be too focused on new games. I don't think they want to recycle their content like that. It's like, I, we, I do know they recycle, like, stuff for the maps but that's the maps you know i don't think they're gonna recycle a whole game but um hopefully they do this you know but like i said let's try and share this video and see if any of the developers see this i hope they do um it'd be it's really cool man like the idea of it i love it i like it a lot but uh let's go ahead and share this video guys that is gonna be it for the video today guys stay tuned this week or next week for some let's plays and that is it guys peace